What you waiting on? Go get one. <sighs> so good. So refreshing. Hey, y'all. Hey, y'all. So I am going to do this review super quick. I'm going to be very, very honest. Um, The do's and don'ts. Okay. So this is the product we're going to be talking about. The um Mr. Coffee Maker Plus Hot. You guys, off the bat, let me tell y'all, I'm in love with this machine. <laughs> Just simply in love with this machine. When I tell you I have turned my machine into a coffee tea maker, yes, you guys. So let me go over everything really fast. So this is the um box that it comes in. So I got it at Ross. Let me show you guys how much it was. The original price, 40 I got it for $19.99. What a steal. So <laughs> this um this is it. So um they only have these on eBay now. And um I saw one at uh Walmart, but it doesn't have the code part, but you still can work it. So let's get into this. So you guys, I went to um the Rainbow Store Grocery Outlet, and I found all of these IHOP Buttery Syrup Coffees, you guys, and they were um, 97 cents, so I got 10 boxes, and it was some more there, but I left those other four for somebody else, okay? I ain't want to be too greedy, <laughs> but so I left them other um, boxes there, and then I also grabbed this one right here, which was $20 for 80 pods, so I grabbed this one. And the reason why I grabbed this one is because when I was looking for the um, uh, coffee that comes in a um, bag or whatnot, you guys, that coffee was like um, $10, $11, $12, and I was like, absolutely not, not going to do it. So when I stumbled across these, I was like, you know what? Perfect deal because I get 80 and I could do a lot with these coffees because with the buttery, you know, they have flavoring and so on and so on. You guys know. So this is what I did. It works for me. I love it. And you guys can see the holiday blend, the hazelnut, the pumpkin and the chocolate. So that's what I got. And then I also use my coffee maker. And I make cold brew tea, you guys. And I also make hot tea. So I'm going to get into that. I'm just trying to hurry up and, you know, get into this video because I don't want to make it super long. So, and I also found powdered milk or whatnot. So um, it's perfect for your coffee. I want you to guys to see that for baking and, um, you know, whatever else you guys need it for. So this is an awesome product. Love it too. And then this, these are the teas that I use inside of my, um, Mr. Coffee Maker. You can put your tea inside of here. If you don't want to put this loose tea in here, you could just put it inside of here, pour your hot water here and your hot water comes here and it goes in there. So, and this is my other um, brand of tea. That's peach. And this one is raspberry. Okay. I'll be right back. And also, if you run out of your pods at any given time, you still can use it. If you don't have your regular, you know, coffee in a bag or whatever, you can use the instant coffee. All you have to do to um, this, take a spoon, however much you like, pour it inside of here. Put your hot water in here. Baby, you got a cup of coffee. Okay? Because a lot of people, you know, were like, oh, yeah, you know, you have to use this, this, that. No, you don't. Absolutely not. Mine's work just fine. So let me show you guys the recipe. So here is the different coffees you guys can make. Iced coconut and churro. Skinny girl. Sweet cream, you guys. Boom, boom. And you guys can just look and do what you do okay and that's pretty much it like i said i really enjoy this machine i love it and i use it and i'm in love with it you guys and hold on so it shows you where to put your water and then it shows you where to put your ice 
sure you guys read this guide. Clean your machine. Take a cup of water. Run it through your reservoir machine. Let it clean it, okay? Okay, so it makes coffee in about three minutes. But I want to show you guys um, about the tea, okay? Because I know you guys are pretty, like, curious about the tea part. So let's get into that. Okay, so I'm going to pour my water. Okay, so I'm going to pour my water. I'm going to move this in the, this here. If you just forget to do it, it does it for you. <laughs> All right. I forgot to show you. Here's your settings. Hot brew and over ice. So I'm going to do... Oh, I forgot to put the ice. Hold on. So I'm not even going to worry about the ice, y'all. I'm just going to take my tea. Pour it in there. And then I'm going to press over ice. And then I'll be back once it starts doing what it's supposed to do. Don't worry about the back. <laughs> And it shuts itself off, you guys. I love this machine. And if you need it to be sweetened, you can add your some honey, sugar, whatever you like. But I'll be back after all this is done. All right, guys, guess what? It is all done. So here is my tea, y'all. Here it is. What do you guys think? Will you get one? Ugh, I'm trying to show you. Uh, it's just, you know, no more water, so it's steaming. But that's it. I also want to say no coffee, no sugar. I mean, no coffee. No sugar gets in this part. And clean up is a cinch, you guys. So you can make your um, iced tea.